Hi, I'm Cherry Daly from the Love Athletes program. Um, right now, last week, I was at a pro tournament. Okay, so we got we left here on Friday. No, sorry, Sunday. I signed in, and then on Monday I played my first match. Very good. Played. I played very very well. Really happy. My second match on Tuesday played very very well. I was very very happy as well. And Wednesday we were waiting around in all the club, and this happens a lot to us tennis players. Like because of like the tournament, if it starts off on clay, then they they can move it to indoor. But the indoor courts that they had, they could only use two, and we were so many girls playing, so it just wasn't gonna work. So they decided to cancel it for the day. After we were waiting around all day trying to play they were like okay they were like okay it's fine you can go home so we went home well back to the hotel um the day after that i had my first round of the main draw because i was playing qualies before that so i was very happy to even get in the main draw and once i got in the main draw i played against another english girl and honestly it was one of an it was one of my best matches in my whole life I served very very well. I felt very very good. Like after my injury, I've never played like this. Like after being out for such a long time, I never thought I'd feel like this again. And finally, I felt like this playing against that girl. Um and I ended up winning that match, which I was so so happy. It was my first like big win in a pro tournament. So I was very very happy about that. After waiting around um, so I eventually get to play on the Thursday and um, yeah and then the Friday I went to play again we were there at 8 a.m. in the morning just waiting around um, and then all of a sudden it started raining so as the rain came we were like okay the forecast says it's gonna stop at 10 let's say not before 12 because we have to clean the courts we have to wait anyway by this time, there's already been two people that have withdrew that have just left the tournament because they can't deal with it anymore. So it's a lot of patience to stay there the whole week. But I was like, you know what? I'm staying here. I'm going to win this. Let's go. Anyway, so it was no before 12. Then also not before 4. Then not before 6. And then the sunset went down. So there was no play then either. So I had to wait till the Friday, sorry, the Saturday. And on Saturday I played a match and I was generally mentally tired. Um, I, everyone else withdrew apart from my opponent. So I had to play my second match and um, a lot of the other girls, they, they just got a bye because 11 withdrawals in the whole tournament 11 11 people withdrew and we are 32 people and 11 of us withdrew from the tournament it's crazy what the girls that won the doubles they didn't even they only played three games in the whole tournament three games like not even matches three games is like the 40 love so they were 2-1 up and the girls retired and then they got to buy the next round they got to buy the next round they got to buy in the final So they won the tournament playing three games, not even in one match, like just a quarter of a match, not even a quarter, and they won the tournament, which is crazy, it really is, and it just shows that like what rain can actually do as well to people mentally, like I was so dead on Saturday, we got there at eight, I warmed up, and what my, my warm-up partner her uber got cancelled or something so she couldn't get there on time so i ended up having to warm up with my coach which was i mean it was good it was good but yeah it was just out of the routine we started off bad already and then i got put on my court at nine and i fell straight on my face because the court was still wet at the back and they, they didn't even realize like they were looking at it and they just didn't really care anymore they just wanted us to play and i was like okay let's see how it goes and i just fell so we had to stop our match we had to move to another car we went on that car it was wet look, look. 
you know like it was just such a stress to like we moved three times during our whole match and we must have stopped for like an hour the first time we had to move because we had to wait till the other dry the courts were dry and honestly it was a bit of a week but you know i'm really really happy i play very very well and I mean, now my shoulder hurts a little bit, but I'm going to go to the physio tomorrow. I've got a day off tomorrow, so I really can't wait for that. I have an exam in the morning, so I had to study during that. And yeah, hopefully soon I can climb a bit more of them rankings, play a bit more of these um, tournaments. It's very hard to get in at the moment because of COVID. They, um, a lot of girls would want to play everything because they just want to get their points back up again after COVID losing everything. So it's quite hard at the moment for us to get in if you don't have any points. But now that I've won around in the main draw, hopefully I'll starting like I'll have more of an opportunity to get in them. So soft. So yeah, hopefully it goes well. And where I played was Hilton Head Island. It was the most beautiful place I've ever seen. Like honestly, if it didn't rain, it would have been such a nice tournament. It was sunny. It was nice the first couple of days and. We went to the beach to look there because it's like a resort island. It's like a typical island where all of the tourists go. So, yeah.